with cow dung and water needs to be spread uniformly in the pond. About one kilogram of fresh azola culture is needed for a pond of six four feet size. It must be applied uniformly in the pond. Biogas slurry can also be used instead of dung. The depth of water should be four to six inches. Selection of site. It is better to select an area near the house to ensure regular upkeep and monitoring of the pond. A suitable water source should be nearby for a regular water supply. The site under partial shade is ideal or else, shade must be created to reduce the evaporation of water and, for better growth of azola. The floor area of the pond should be free of pointed stones, roots, and thorns that can puncture the sheet and cause leakage of water. Pond size and construction. The size of the pond depends on factors like the Azola can be fed to the livestock either in fresh or dried form. It can be given directly or mixed with concentrates to cattle, poultry, sheep, goat, pigs, and rabbits. In the studies with over 100 dairy farmers done in India, feeding of Azola at 800 grams on an average per day, improved the monthly milk yield by at least 10 liters per cow. It takes a few days for the animals to get used to the taste of Azola. Azola must be washed thoroughly with fresh water to remove the smell of dung. Firstly mix with other foods and provide it to animals after a few days when provide Azola alone for animals. For plants, harvested Azola dry well and make dust and it is put to the near of plant stem soil. Thank you.